So, I am not giving you any guarantee about this meditation. To be frank enough, I cannot give you any guarantee about this meditation because I may not be able to explain in a proper way. Mm-hmm. It's because they don't try. You translate it. Allora, lui, Mr. Raju, non ci dà nessuna garanzia sulla, su questa meditazione eh, perché forse non è in grado forse di spiegarla. Forse non è neanche in grado di spiegarla. E infatti io ho detto io provo a tradurre. Right? Beh, aiutatemi. But I will try to explain as far as I know. That's all. After uh, knowing this, you may develop uh, that also I don't know. But my duty is, because this is the part of the lecture, spiritual healing lecture, I will try to make you understand uh, to the best of my knowledge. Questo qui fa parte di una lezione della, della guarigione spirituale e per cui ci tiene a trasmettercela e sta face, farà il meglio um, di quello che gli permette la sua conoscenza a spiegarcela. So you will read the entire lecture by yourself, I uh, told you, go to the, the World, World Teacher Trust website and this is the latest book printed by me of the EKS lectures, this is the fourth volume and uh, some spiritual constitution. Questo è, noi leggeremo, voi leggerete, noi leggeremo il libro per conto nostro e lo potete trovare su questo sito World Teachers Trust. World Teacher Trust. No, Teachers. World Teacher Trust. Questo qui è l'ultimo testo. Pubblicato.org. Okay, you put the uh, yeah. And uh, one, one, uh, one very beautiful man, not beautiful, he's not this beautiful, a nice man, his name is Lurjev. He's from Berna. Berna. Mm-hmm. And he's uh, very fond of Master E.K. and very close disciple of Master Bharati Kumar. Whatever I print, I will send uh, the English books to him and he will put it in the website of. Uh, Uh, World Teacher Trust. Mm-hmm. And Maurya, my son is also making another very beautiful uh, website uh, only to put the books of Master E.K. Mm-hmm. In the World Teacher Trust uh, you will get the books of Master E.K. and you will uh, get the lectures of Master E.K. audio. Mm-hmm. And English, both English and other lectures. Mm-hmm. And also you will get the lectures of uh, books of Master Bharati Kumar. World Teacher Trust. But Maurya is making a, a website, Kolpati Book Trust. Org. We did not release it so far. Mm-hmm. He is uh, now trying to put all the books in the Kolpati Book Trust. Org. Mm-hmm. I am the chairman of the Kolpati Book Trust. If anybody wanted to publish or do anything of Master E.K.'s books, mm-hmm. they have to take my permission. Mm-hmm. I am the global chairman of the Kulpati Book Trust. Kulpati Book Trust means, is Kulpati Book Trust mm-hmm. means, this is the organization of the master's books. Mm-hmm. So I am the total in charge, a global in charge of the master E.K.'s books. Mm-hmm. So if you wanted to read any lectures given by the master E.K. in uh, Geneva and Amsterdam and uh, Brussels and so many places in Munich, And uh, he did not come to Basel and uh, uh, Lugano, but he went, all the time he goes to Geneva. Mm-hmm. And all the lectures you will find in this four, this is the fourth volume. Mm-hmm. There are four volumes. And some books are there in uh, German also. Mm-hmm. You, can, you can download them freely. Uh, they put it free. So you, can, you can go and... Uh, and the, uh, why I'm telling you this is, If you read the complete lecture of uh, spiritual uh, healing, then you may go into this meditation by understanding all the things, it's the 35 pages of lecture, you see. And if you go through the lecture, then you may understand uh, better than what I am telling you now, mm-hmm. right? To be frank enough. Mm-hmm. 
Allora se lui, eh, se voi leggete questi testi, questo testo intero, potete capirlo, potete capire meglio quello che ci sta attorno a quello che ci sta spiegando adesso. E prima di questo ci ha detto che appunto ci sono il suo figlio, sta preparando un sito dove verranno scaricati tutti i libri del, eh, di maestro Eki e, e che invece in questo sito che ci ha detto prima voi potete scaricare tutti i testi che sono messi a disposizione, ci sono dei testi anche tedesco e, ed è libero. E che comunque tutti i testi che passeranno pubblicati, il permesso bisogna chiederlo a Mister Raggio perché lui ha, il, ha i diritti, insomma. So, for ever the information I will read one sentence and how difficult it is to understand. Uh, so, we, so you will understand that electricity is space. He is telling that. So you will understand that electricity is space. Così voi capirete come l'elettricità è spazio. Elettricità è spazio. Right? And space made active is electricity. Space made active is electricity. Lo spazio attiva l'elettricità. E lo spazio reso attivo, attivo. l'elettricità. Diventa elettricità. Lo spazio attiva l'elettricità. No. no. Lo spazio attivato diventa elettricità. Okay. Lo spazio attivato diventa elettricità. Okay, and electricity made potential is space. L'elettricità fatta, fatto, eh, no, potenziato, sì. ecco, potenziato, è made is space. space. Il potenziale, repeat l'elettricità, huh? can you repeat it also? Yes. Yeah. Space made active is electricity. Mm -hmm. Space made active mm -hmm. is electricity electricity made potential is space okay. allora uh, can you uh, i will translate now can you read it more uh, yes, one, yes. One space made active is electricity lo spazio che è stato attivato fa uh, elettricità and electricity made potential is space. L'elettricità che è stata potenziata fa spazio. Crea spazio. Yeah, you just need spazio. it. Mm -hmm. Spazio. Mm -hmm. Ma l'essere potenziato non è, secondo me non è la traduzione giusta, è più potenzialmente. Perché mm -hmm. essere mm -hmm. potenziato vuol dire che tu gli dai qualcosa. So you, you, you read uh, the entire... Uh, Uh, lecture, then you can understand better. Because he, he, he explained so many things and then finally he gave a statement. Yeah. Unless you read the entire lecture, mm -hmm. you cannot understand the, a simple statement. Mm -hmm. That's why I told you, you read the entire lecture and then he explained so many things step by step and step by step and they, he gave a final statement. Mm -hmm. If you understand that, you have to go through the entire lecture. So don't worry about it. Se, se volete capire veramente il senso, qua potremmo anche filosofare, no? Sulla, sulle, se volete veramente capire il senso di quello che state dicendo, dovete leggere tutto il testo, così arrivate alla comprensione. Then you will understand, no problem. But it's like water and ice, yes. the same principle. Yes, the same principle. It follows the same principle, but it is a little more higher. Ok, now I'm going to the uh, meditation part. Mm -hmm. I am telling you again, there is no technique here to meditate. Mm -hmm. there is, in, this, in this part, there is no technique here to meditate. We are used to meditate with a technique. Mm -hmm. Here you will not find any technique to meditate. So what is the use of it? Whether you have to experience it or not, that is the only matter here. Unless you understand uh, the total lecture, step by step and slowly and slowly, then we will be able to understand what actually he is trying to teach us. If you read the entire lecture, then you will understand what he is trying to teach us. 
that is enough. The next step is the meditation. This is not the meditation, but it is the meditation. But there is nothing to understand here. Suppose, for example, I will give an example. Suppose uh, if you give me a sugar, for example, a sweet, then how is it? It is so nice. Can you explain what is so nice? You have to you have to take the sugar and you have to take the chocolate. Oh, it is so nice. What is nice? Can you explain? Yeah. It's a taste. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is the higher meditations. <coughs> These are the higher meditations. There is nothing to explain there. And whether you go into the meditation or not, whether it will take 10 years or 20 years or 30 years or 10 minutes, that we don't know. But it is only an experience there is no explanation. That's why I'm trying to uh, uh, postpone and postpone and postpone. Okay. Because you will be totally disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> After I, I read this meditation, oh, what is there? That's why I'm trying to postpone and postpone to prepare a platform. Even now, that's why I'm telling you there is no guarantee from my side. I will just read. And leave it. Um, Mr. Al Jose, col testo che abbiamo letto prima, con la frase, dobbiamo leggere tutta la lezione per capirla, mentre adesso ci proverà a spiegare la meditazione, che però non è una meditazione, ma è una meditazione, come ci ha spiegato ieri, non c'è tecnica, per cui mh, proverà a spiegarcela più possibilmente, cioè più, meglio di quello che, che, che può. E l'esempio che ha fatto per capire quello che vuole dirci è come se voi ricevete un dolce, no? dite mm, che buono, ma cos'è buono nel dolce? È un gusto, è la stessa cosa nella meditazione, è un, un gusto, una sensazione, bisogna farlo. È difficile bisogna, da spiegare. Bisogna viverlo, è ecco. È difficile da spiegare. Sì, sì. Even then you are interested, then I will complete. <laughs> After telling all these things, even if you say, oh, you are interested, then I will go for it. Excuse me, I lost Okay, so now I will read uh, only one sentence, then you translate. Okay. Now close your eyes. <laughs> no, no, don't do it. Now close your eyes. And observe your lungs respiration. E osservate i vostri polmoni, la respirazione dei vostri polmoni. And observe the movement of your blood circulation. E osservate il, il movimento della circolazione del sangue. And understand that something is being generated, generated in you. E osservate che qualcosa è stato generato dentro di voi. This is no problem. This, this is what we used to do it. Eh? This, this, this thing is no problem. Now close your eyes and observe your lungs respiration, observe your lungs respiration and observe the movement of your blood circulation and understand that something is being generated in you. This is, this is the, we have to reach that point, third point, what is that? Understand that something is being generated in you. This is the experience, right? L'esperienza è quello di capire che qualcosa è stato generato dentro di voi. And now we are coming to the point. And uh, the space, and the space where you are sitting or standing is a big lake of that energy of force. Allora, e lo spazio dove voi siete seduti o in piedi è un grande lago it's a big lake of energy of force. Dell'energia della for- di forza. Right? There we yesterday space energy. So you, there you first started the water and ice and then what the spirit and then matter and atom and atom is the spirit and then energy in the uh, space and uh, space is the spirit, and finally he said space energy. Now, this is the continuation of that uh, explanation. What is that? And the space where you are sitting or standing. The space where you are sitting or standing, the space around you. 
all of us we are sitting in the room so take out the room out we have to change the word we are sitting in the space allora adesso eh, il concetto è quello di se noi siamo seduti tutti qua in uno spazio siamo seduti in una sala ma dobbiamo eh, togliere l'idea della sala e vederci noi seduti in uno spazio in sense, we have to change the understanding uh, levels we are thinking that you are uh, sitting in the room but you have to change into the next dimension we are sitting in the space dobbiamo cambiare dimensione non siamo più seduti in uno spazio ma siamo seduti eh, scusate in una sala ma siamo seduti in uno spazio even the thought itself changes many things even this understanding itself changes many things anche solo la comprensione di questo cambia tanto understand even the thought itself change many things so i told you many times in many of my classes when there is no building here when there is no building here then what is there here space allora space. se non c'è qua costruzione cosa c'è qua when there is no building here what is there before there is a space in the space we build this building in questo spazio noi abbiamo costruito questa costruzione hey. then again what is there inside the building here what is there cosa c'è dentro space. in questa costruzione lo spazio this is the information we don't know about it this is the information after the building after the building there is a space inside the building there is a space between two spaces there are the walls mm. in the same way around us there is a space inside there is a space in between there is the physical body mm. allora è l'esempio della costruzione che al di fuori della costruzione c'è lo spazio all'interno della costruzione c'è lo spazio e quello che fa il confine sono le mura e la stessa cosa nel nostro da noi fuori di noi c'è lo spazio nel nostro interno c'è lo spazio e quello che, il, che limita è il corpo right so what is the what is the barrier here is the physical body why you are not why we are not so spiritual you know why we are not so spiritual all the time we believe that we are the physical body Mm-hmm. Allora quello che la, la barriera, quello che ci limita è il nostro corpo e noi non siamo spirituali perché pensiamo di essere corpo. Because we are living with the spiritual we are living with the physical body that all the time we believe that we are physical. Noi viviamo solo con il corpo pensando che eh, siamo corpo. But what is there outside space? What is there inside space? Two spaces are there in between you are. That's why we have to try to elevate ourselves in our thinking levels we are not just physical beings we are something we are something else allora fuori, fuori di noi c'è lo spazio dentro di noi c'è lo spazio e noi dobbiamo allenarci ad alzare il livello per arrivare alla comprensione che non siamo solo corpo ma che c'è qualcosa d'altro che siamo right. qualcosa d'altro Suppose if uh, if I take this paper Suppose what is you 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 please don't uh, look at the lines you just feel this is total white paper what is there here nothing that is the space mm-hmm. so when so se voi guardate questo foglio qualche foglio non c'è So if I put here on down. What happens? It's a dot in the space. No. no. It's our body. The total is the space uh-huh. and uh, I put the dot here. Uh-huh. Something is here and space is separated. Okay. Uh-huh. Total space and something is here. This is how the creation come out uh-huh. from the space. Then this is our one. Sorry, Mr. Ajo. Uh, se voi guardate questo come spazio allora e, e lui mette un punto cosa vedete uno spazio che uh, scompare e la, il punto che appare right? before uh, this dot there is nothing 
Prima del punto non c'era niente. Ma everything is there. But there is nothing. You can't see anything. Everything is there in the space. Unless there is something in the space, the creation of all the globes, they cannot come out. You understand? All the globes and suns and the earth and moon and all these solar systems, millions of solar systems, everything will be there in the space in an invisible way. Nobody can see anything there. Unless something come out. In questo spazio c'è già tutto, tutto l'universo, i pianeti e tutto, ma eh, nessuno li vede finché, non è, finché qualcosa non esce. Then there is the sun, is the first. Then uh, there are the galaxies and this and that and that and become, one become many. Right? Finché è uscito il primo che è il sole, poi ci sono tutte le galassie e tutte le cose. Ecco. Right? So, here what you have to understand only Before there is a space, after there is a space, inside there is a space, but we are not aware of that, we are aware of only one thing, we are the physical beings. That is the limitation here. And once you understand the space outside and the space inside, you are not the physical body, you are the space by yourself. That's why yesterday Master told here, what he told? Space energy, yeah. you can call it also like a God. You can also call it as a God, God consciousness. C'è lo spazio dentro, c'è lo spazio fuori, ma noi siamo convinti che siamo solo corpo fisico. Adesso l'ho perso l'aggancio, mi aiutate? Space energy, la sintesi di tutto è che... Che lo spazio, energia, sì, c'era un passaggino, ma fa niente. So now we understand, uh, even in the meditation, again we are uh, meditating uh, the color, uh, the shape, our idol, is it uh, logical? Allora ho pensato che nella meditazione... Yes, pure common sense. <laughs> <laughs> Already we are in the physical body, present here, and uh, we are not aware of the space inside and space outside, we are not aware of the God consciousness. Already we traveled for a long time, much more grasser and much more grasser and we are imprisoned in the physical body. Again in the meditation, you, again you are going back uh, to visualize, uh, to worship a form like that, is not so uh, practical. So you understand yourself, yourself is a space. And <laughs> the space, the body is formed. Water should be there. And out of the water, ice block will come out. Again, what next? Again, ice block has to become the water. water. So we are made up of space, or we are made up of God consciousness. Today or tomorrow, we are the ice blocks. Water is the space. Right? We are the atoms. Energy is the energy is the space. We have to go back in your understanding, and you have to understand ourselves as a space, not as a physical being. Uh, Kari. No. Allora, eh, noi dobbiamo capire che eh, c'è lo spazio fuori, lo spazio dentro, eh, e che non è, cioè non anche il nostro corpo è spazio, non è un corpo fisico. E lo spazio viene qui, eh, paragonato anche alla consciousness alla coscienza di, della divini, del divino okay. eh, ed è la stessa teoria come con l'acqua e il ghiaccio che l'acqua diventa ghiaccio ma il ghiaccio ridiventa acqua per cui dobbiamo superare la nostra, eh, la nostra credenza andare oltre e capire che anche noi siamo spazio che non siamo nel limite che non ci limitiamo nel, nella credenza di essere corpo fisico The body is illusion in some way because it's made of atoms and atoms is nothing. Energy. And space around. Energy, this is what is there, it's clear. The body is like the ice, the ice is a form of... You understand? So there is nothing to meditate here, it's only the understanding whether you will be in the state or not. It is the only matter here. What is there to meditate here? Is an understanding whether we can go into that state or not. That is the only matter here. Right? 
il, 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 la domanda, il problema qui è, è nella, nella cioè della meditazione e la comprensione di capire se riusciamo ad andare in questo stato o meno. Ok, then I'm, so far it is so far it is okay. Va bene, fino so no problem. Eh? So far is it okay? Yes. Yes, ok. We are not telling yes. 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 <laughs> okay. Then, so I don't think it is so difficult, eh? We are going, <laughs> we are going smooth. Okay. And the, you, you remember this all the time. And the space, and the space where you are sitting or standing is a big lake of that energy of force You always remember, this is, this is a very beautiful line. And the space where you are sitting or standing is a big lake of that energy of force. You have to feel it always. We are, we are, we are not sitting in the chair. We are not sitting uh, in the room. We are not sitting in the house. We are not sitting on any physical matter. We feel that we are sitting in the energy of space. This thing always we have to remember. Dovete ricordarvi quotidianamente che non siete seduti su una sedia, in una casa, ma che siete seduti nello spazio. You understand? So I will give you a small example. Suppose uh, when you are uh, sitting in your house, Then you live as you like. You put your leg like this and leg like this and leg like this and put leg like this. We can sit as we like. Suppose uh, if we go to the temple, for example, or if we go to the church, or if we go to, the, uh, go to meet a holy man or a holy place, <coughs> can you behave like that? Why? Because we are aware, we are not in our own house, we are in a church or in a mosque or in a temple or in a holy place. We try to be so calm and peaceful and we follow certain discipline. It is a feeling. In that, it is a feeling. You understand? The same child, same room, same carpet, same human beings. Even then we change everything, it is the attitude. Mm -hmm. So you, if you go further, we have to understand, we are not just human, humans, we are not just sitting in a room, we are not just sitting on the chair, we have to transcend yourself to a feeling that we are sitting in the space of energy. Mm -hmm. Allora, se voi siete a casa seduti potete sdravaccarvi come volete perché siete a casa vostra. Se voi uscite e andate in un luogo sacro, in uno spazio di culto, oppure incontrate una persona eh, di rispetto, automaticamente cambiate eh, posizione, sarete in una posizione di rispetto. E, la stessa cosa, eh, no, questa cosa, voi siete comunque le stesse persone sedute su una sedia, ma è il feeling, è una, è una sensazione che cambia ed è la stessa cosa ehm, che dovete prendere in quanto attitudine e di arrivare a, a questo cambiamento di una sensazione, cioè a comprendere, e capire che siete seduti in uno spazio. Ok, and next, coming to the next point, when it is made active, It means space. When it is made active, you call it your life force. Quando When you made it active, it means space. When you made the space active, then you call it as your life force. Quando voi attivate lo spazio, voi lo chiamerete forza della vita. You understand? How to make it active? E come si fa attivare? Just a feeling. No prayer and no meditation. No technique here. Whenever you are sitting here, you, instead of uh, feeling, you, instead of feeling, I am sitting in the chair, I am sitting in the room, I am sitting in the temple, instead of that, 
you feel yourself that you are in the space, sitting in the space with a lot of energy around you. This is what we call space made active. Attivare lo spazio vuol dire che stare seduti e sentire che siamo nello spazio. That's e it. un sentimento, un feeling. You have to, all the time you have to make, you have to make the space active with your understanding. It's the feeling that you are sitting somewhere else and you have to feel that you are in the space energy, you are sitting in the space, outside there is a space, inside there is a space, we are sitting in the space. That's how the space around you will be activated and that should be your life force. Allora, questa forza della vita, quello che dovrebbe diventare la nostra forza della vita, eh, avviene quando si attiva l'energia che c'è attorno a noi. Vuol dire che quando noi siamo seduti in uno spazio e sentiamo che siamo attorniati da energia, che dentro di noi, fuori da noi c'è energia, siamo nell'energia, avviene questo. Quando entriamo in questa comprensione. È ok? È giusto, non lo metti, eh? Just try to understand very quickly. Don't meditate. Don't Questo close your eyes. Non è Just try to understand what I am trying to tell you and what Master is trying to tell you. Try to put your, the entire mind on the teaching. Don't meditate. Non entrate in There is med- like nothing to be meditated here. Right? In meditazione provate semplicemente a capire, comprendere le parole che io dico e che il Maestro dico. When it is made active, you call it your life force. When, the, when it is passive, you call it space. Quando è, When it is passive, you call it space. Quando è, è passivo, lo chiamate spazio. You understand? How can I repeat it? Passive? Yes, I will, I, will, I will read this entire sentence, huh? you can understand English. Uh, and the space where you are sitting and standing, or standing is a big lake of that energy of force. And when it is made active, you call it your life force. When it is passive, you call it space. Passive means when you are not feeling anything, it remains as a space. Already it is space. But when you activate it, when you feel that space is the energy, when you feel that you are sitting in the energy, that energy is nothing but the space, When you feel like that, then it will be activated and that, that is what we call the life force. If without, without any feeling, just come here and sitting like this on the chair and discussing something else, the space remains as passive. So that means it depends on you how... Exactly. How Already space is there. Okay. Already space is there. You have to activate the space. So with your switch, thought. We switch it on. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's, that's Already it is there. Mm-hmm. That's amazing. Amazing. But that, you see that, that is a healing potential. Uh, healing is a very small word. <laughs> a very, very small word. And uh, everything, that's that why every time I used to tell you one sentence. Everything is there inside. Mm-hmm. Everything is there everywhere. We are God by ourselves. God is everywhere, in you and me, in me, in me, everywhere. There is nothing to be seen. There is nothing to be achieved. There is nothing to be found. Because already it is there. Whether you are looking at it or not, this is the only thing here. And I gave you one beautiful example. I gave this example many times. Suppose uh, there is a glass And uh, suppose it's the candle, for example, if you mm-hmm. put a glass on it, open glass. Mm-hmm. If you leave like that, what happens? Uh, the smoke come out of the lamp, and if you leave like that, if you leave that like that, slowly and slowly the smoke come out of the glass, the, the fire, it will cover. Mm-hmm. Generally we clean every day. Mm-hmm. Generally we clean every day. Suppose if you forget to clean, layer by layer and by layer by layer, it will become much more dark and much more dark and much more dark and much more dark. 
one time, one day will come, we cannot see the light. You can see only the dark layers of the smoke. That means uh, there is a light, is there or not? The light is there already, but uh, you are not able to see the light because there is a lot, the layers of smoke. So if you want to see the light, what you have to do? Again, uh, you are going to light, uh, switch the light or you are going to take away the smoke. What you will do? You will try to take away one layer and one layer without breaking the, with the we should not break. <laughs> this is a physical body. The light is the soul here. All the outer layers are nothing but our different layers of, different planes of our physical body. So inside uh, the light is here, what we are doing, we are cleaning uh, layer by layer and layer by layer, layer by layer. Then if you clean one layer, you will see a dim light. If you go to the second layer, if you can find a much more light. If you clean everything, you see the light there, which is, which is, which is already there. We are not putting a separate light. No Christian light and no Muslim light, mm -hmm. no Indian light, no Hindu light, no Buddhist light. Light is a light. Yeah. The procedure what you follow to clean, those are the religions. One religion speak about one thing and another thing. So everything is only same. We have to learn how to clean the light. And then once uh, the darkness, uh, the smoke is cleaned, you, you see the light there. This is the best example you have to understand. Mr. Raju, I don't know if I can ask this question, it's hard to ask, but if you understand that this is just like rings of smoke and you you break through the idea of space and matter, yeah. would there be any purpose in being here? That is the next that is the next lecture. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to deviate from this. Okay. <laughs> Again you have to come to the elementary class. <laughs> if I wanted to answer you, again I will come to the elementary okay. right? I am speaking right? Elementary, elementary class. class. Now we are in the higher class. Okay. Well, enjoy that. Okay. <laughs> okay. Fine. So, what, what you have to understand, whenever you are sitting in the space, you feel like you are sitting in the energy, <coughs> a lake of energy, not just in the room, mm -hmm. okay? Right. When, there is a, when there is a thought, the space will be activated mm -hmm. as your life force. Mm -hmm. but, but if you sit like this idly without any thought, and space will be like that, but you cannot activate the space, then it will become passive. Mm -hmm. It is a thought process. Right? It's, it's so simple, eh? mm -hmm. unless I said it is so difficult, mm -hmm. <laughs> it is so simple. <laughs> okay. When it is passive, we call it space. Mm -hmm. When your body stands in space, when your body stands in space, the space in your body is active. Lo spazio nel vostro corpo è attivo. Understand? When you are standing in the space, your space in your body will be active, you're active, and when you come out, when you come out, the same, the same space becomes passive, and we call it space. Allora, e se uscite, lo stesso spazio diventa passivo, e lo chiamiamo spazio. Shall I, uh, shall I give you a beautiful example? Yes. And I, I found it yesterday, when I, when I am coming out of my room. Because I have been thinking uh, how to explain this meditation, that's why I am postponing that, because it's not so easy. Then when I am coming out, when I opened my room, automatically the light was on. Again, when I pass from that light to the other room, it is automatically off. That is the best example. Allora, se l'esempio migliore e pratico che si può dare, che Mr. Raggio ieri ha pensato come spiegare la meditazione, 
è che quando è entrato sì. nella sua camera si è acceso la luce e uscendo dalla camera nella prossima camera quella luce si è spenta. The last thing is I'm, I'm breaking my head. How I, for example, I can give coming out of the space and coming into the space, space active and space passive. I don't know, I never think about the example. So I was thinking like this and like this I'm thinking about getting some example. When I come out of my room, it is automatically on. Mm. When I pass uh, from that place to the other uh, room, it is automatically oh. off. Mm. Yeah. Good teacher, eh? <laughs> <laughs> so I am so happy. Yeah. Oh, I got it now. This is what he is telling. If you feel that you are in energy, if you feel when you come to, when, when you sit somewhere or when you stand somewhere, if you feel the space, then energy, life energy will be there, then space is active. And if you come out of that thought mm -hmm. and go to your business or something else or something else or something else, whatever it may be, come out of that thought, again space will become passive. That's why, oh, one minute. That's why Master Maurya said in one of his lectures, one of his, uh, Master Jalko wrote uh, 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 about the teaching of Master Maurya. It is so beautiful teaching. When you are aware of, when you are aware that you are the God consciousness, those are the moments of your life. We are living means whenever you are aware, the time, a second or a minute or hour, whatever it may be, when you are aware of your beingness as the God consciousness, you are living. When you forget about it and live your own life, you are dead. That means not physical death. You are dead at uh, God consciousness and you will become the man conscious. Yeah. God conscious and the human consciousness. Yeah. When you are aware that you are the God consciousness, uh, for me you are a living being. When once you come out of the God consciousness and uh, live with your human consciousness, you are dead to the God consciousness. Yeah. So it's beautiful. Yeah. Says so what is what Master is telling when you feel you are sitting in the space and it will you you are activating itself uh, the space is activated for you mm -hmm. and you come out of the space to go to that part this space will become passive that space will become active mm -hmm. say I am here the space is active if I am here. This space is active and the space is passive. Again, if I come here, so the space is active because space is here, mm -hmm. space is here, they both will talk to each other. Hi, how are you? <laughs> we should not interfere. <laughs> there is the problem. We understand interfere. I am Dominic, a Swiss German, a uh, Swiss man. I am a Razu, I am a Indian, I am a Hindu. This is the interview. For this space there is no Hindu and no Muslim and no India and no Switzerland. Mm -hmm. So we have to learn to live as a space mm -hmm. the, with God consciousness. Huh? This is not so difficult. Eh? Mm -hmm. Yes. But that is very difficult, but it is so, so beautiful. But uh, Mr. Raju, yes. like uh, if I look there and I forget about uh, this space, I active that space that I am looking there. No. No. That is passive to you. When you are there, that is active. When you go from there to there, then that space will become active. So? So what you are telling, what you are asking me, can I activate that space also? Yes. Next class. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you are right. Yeah. So he Thomas, Thomas is also right, you are also right. Yeah. He came down, you wanted to go up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Both are very good. Mm -hmm. I, I will explain to you afterwards. So I you know you are asking, 
uh, if you see in the movies uh, or in the scriptures, uh, the great people, they disappear like that. If they stand like this and they disappear and uh, they appear somewhere. That is this. They totally dissolve themselves into the space, into the atoms. Again, uh, when they wanted to show up uh, mm-hmm. in some other country or some, some other place, our planet, again they made all the atoms bring together into the physical form and they will appear mm-hmm. in the physical form. Again, when they wanted to disappear from that space without any flight ticket, <laughs> and, and, and they just dissolve into the atoms, again they go somewhere and they, again they, 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 they will materialize with the same atoms. Master E.K. says it will be possible in the 21st century, uh, the scientist, uh, not the spiritualist, Master E.K. says scientists will come to that state, come to that uh, point where a human being go to a chamber, mm-hmm. a small chamber and he just uh, dissolves himself into the atoms. Again he programs his mind to appear somewhere. Again he will go to a chamber where he can again bring all the atoms, physical atoms and he will take a form. It will be possible even to the scientist, the, uh, the scientist will grow up to that extent. What, what Master E.K. says? This, this was... Oh, sorry. So, allora, all'inizio ha fatto l'esempio di Maestro Moira, 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 Moria, che eh, ha spiegato che se siamo nella coscienza, quel, quell'attimo che noi ci rendiamo conto che mh, viviamo la coscienza divina, siamo in vita. Quando ci togliamo da, questo, da questa esperienza siamo eh, morti, ma non morti fisicamente, ma in quanto esseri spirituali. E la stessa, questo, il, il, paragonando, è la stessa cosa come eh, quello che ha spiegato quando siamo nella consapevolezza dell'energia, dello spazio, sia attiviamo lo spazio o l'energia, lo spazio, eh, spazio. Lo spazio. Viene mentre quando, quando non siamo nella consapevolezza disattiviamo lo spazio. Ok, per parte 1 e poi <ride> e, e, ha fatto l'esempio di questi, come noi possiamo vedere nei film o leggere nei testi, di questi eh, uomini eh, che riescono a a percepirsi in quanto atomi per cui dis- disapparire, ehm, scomparire, di, scomparire di in un posto e riapparire, ricomporsi in un altro posto. E c'è cioè, il maestro Ike mi sembra che ha spiegato che addirittura gli scienziati in un certo punto, della, non so più quando, riusciranno, non gli spirituali, ma gli scienziati riusciranno a ricreare questo, questo fenomeno creando una camera dove si introduce la persona, si scompongono gli atomi e poi possono riprogrammarla in un altro posto del mondo. Ok? okay. It's good, eh? Mm-hmm. Sì. Ah. What happens when you make distance healing? Is it the same? Yes. Uh, you for the you same, distance healing we don't want uh, this depth. Okay. It's the only thought process. Okay. For the distance healing we don't need uh, to the depth of uh, this uh, level. Okay. It's the, it's the, th- it's the th- thought process. Okay. And uh, anyhow, you ask me, I'm telling you, when you feel healing, uh, we can do healings with a method uh, or with a technique uh, that is different uh, from healing with intention. Mm-hmm. Nothing but love. When you, when you understand healing is a science and healing is a method mm-hmm. and healing is a technique to heal somebody, then many things come into the picture. But we have to follow some methods and techniques in the beginning, which is a must, mm-hmm. you understand? Mm-hmm. And don't think uh, they are the small things, and, uh, they are all very important. Mm-hmm. But when, when you come to the next step, and intention plays the main role, intention. Mm-hmm. intention of love. Mm-hmm. Then the intention itself, itself takes uh, the shape, its own shape, mm-hmm. whether, we, whether it will travel uh, from our heart center or travel from the space and goes to the master and come again back 
all these details we did not worry about that. Suppose somebody is not well and uh, we know that and uh, if there is a wish inside, he should be all right with all your real love, mm-hmm. without any expectations, mm-hmm. without any programming. Then generally it will take its own course of action and uh, it will work there. You understand? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, can I translate this? Yes. Can be changed? Yeah, 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 yes, yes. yes. Allora ha chiesto se anche nella, se nella guarigione in lontananza si attiva lo stesso principio. Eh, ma il risposto di sì in un certo senso eh, eh, perché all'inizio quando siamo, lavoriamo per attivare la guarigione dobbiamo imparare delle tecniche che è la base man mano che si va avanti eh, si arriva a, a, a lavorare nella guarigione solo con l'intenzione che però è l'intenzione dell'amore per cui lì si fa un altro passaggio ecco. eh. yes. ok again I will read again When your body stands in space, the space in your body is active and when you, when you come out, the same space becomes passive and we call it space. This is what I explained to you. Mm-hmm. The next sentence is, this is the truth of it. This is the truth of it. And your process of knowing, and this is the truth of it, And your process of knowing, it is called meditation in its true sense. Ho bisogno di aiuto qua. It is the truth. Can you repeat, please? Uh, yes. Can you repeat, please? Please, can you repeat? Yes, 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 yes. we need help. So sure. <laughs> This is the truth of it. Truth. Truth. Il semi della verità. Questa è la verità. Questa è la verità. Questa è la verità. No, of it. Questa è la verità. This is the truth of it. And your process of knowing, when you wanted to know the process, when you wanted to know the process, what is the process when you are in the space, the space is activated, then we call it as active space. When you go out of the space and the space will become the passive because you, you come out of the you come out of the space. This is a process, this is the truth. What Masi is telling, this is the truth of it, and your process of knowing, it is called meditation. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. When you try to understand the process, questo it is called a meditation. Yeah. Questo è la verità, e quando sei nella comprensione del processo, uh-huh. sei nella meditazione. Uh-huh. You see how beautiful it is, huh? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Well, we feel meditation is doing some technique and uh-huh. following some process and this and that. This is, this is you tell you, no. You to, yeah, when you try to understand what is the outer space and what is the inner space, when you stand there and when you stand there, when you feel that you are in this space, how it will be active space. Mm-hmm. When you come out of it and how it will become passive and this space will become active. When you try to understand the process, itself is called the meditation. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Cioè è proprio il processo, quando siamo dentro nella comprensione del processo di entrare, attivare spazi, e questo è il momento che siamo nella meditazione. Right? And he is telling after all, this is the truth of it, and uh, your process of knowing, it is called meditation in its true sense. It is called med- in, in its uh, true sense. You see, next. Na- okay. Not in the sense we use the word meditation blindly. Mm-hmm. Not in the. This is the truth. I will be. This is the truth of it, and your process of knowing it is called meditation in its true sense. Not in the sense we use the word meditation blindly. Okay. Questo è il senso vero, appunto, della meditazione. Not in the, can you please repeat so I can exactly translate, not in the sense of make meditation blind. Yeah. Non nel senso di fare meditazione in maniera cieca. The, to understand, to know the, understand, to understand and to, to know the process of it, it is a, it is a real meditation. But not uh, the meditation what uh, you feel blindly. Mm-hmm. This is the real meditation. Cioè, questa è la vera. 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 Questa è
Questa è la vera, ne, ne, stando in questa comprensione siamo nella vera meditazione. This is the, this is the true meditation, but we, we call meditation in other sense mm -hmm. blindly, without knowing. Quando facevo un altro tipo di meditazione, facevo una meditazione cieca. Mm -hmm. Senza sapere. Senza sapere. Oh, finish? Senza sapere. Senza sapere. Senza sapere. Senza sapere. Mm. So beautiful, eh? Mm. That's why he is a great master. Mm. I have read so many books in my life of the very great people. If they write hundred pages, the master will explain in two sentences. <laughs> <laughs> so we are, we are all so fortunate. To have such a great master. And uh, why, um, I, why I, I like Switzerland is he started his journey from Switzerland. Mm -hmm. He likes Switzerland very much. I don't know the reason. No. All our group, uh, unknowingly, master started from Switzerland. Of course, he started from Brussels, Belgium, mm -hmm. not Switzerland. And he started uh, from Belgium and then uh, he settled in Switzerland. Mm -hmm. He came just for seven times, that's all. Mm -hmm. Sometimes he gives so many beautiful lectures. He gave, he traveled just for seven times. Mm. And uh, he likes Switzerland very much. Mm. After that, Master Bharti Kumar, he, for him, Switzerland has become the base. After that, uh, my friend Amaral, like, now he, he's not coming. He, he also came to Switzerland. And Master E.K.'s son, Ananta Krishna, he used to come and for him, for his, Geneva is the base for him, not... Uh, for me, I came uh, here and Basel was the base. The base, Basel. <laughs> <laughs> Basel was the base and now Logano is the base. It's just so surprising for all of us, uh, without knowing that Switzerland has become uh, the base for all of us. Uh, I don't know why. Maybe Dominic is here, I don't know. <laughs> it's quite funny, Raju. The, the best yogi from Switzerland went all the way to India to meet somebody huh. and couldn't get off the boat. Oh. Yeah. He, sent, he sent all his students, but he couldn't, he couldn't face going to speak to the man that he went to see huh. and back to Switzerland. Why? He couldn't face the man. Huh. He, he sent his students and says, you go and speak to Rama. Who are you there? He went all the way to Switzerland to speak to one of these men and couldn't go off the boat. Hmm. Oh, right? I don't know. <laughs> but he was interested he in the doubts. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> so, I don't know about things, about this. <laughs> I had to Maharishi. Maharishi. Yeah. Yeah. Maharishi, yeah. Maharishi, he is in Sadisberg, it's the lake of Lucerne. Yeah. Yeah, Maharishi, Maharishi. There's a huge yeah. center there. Maharishi. There is a center there opposite to Morsha. Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 Yeah. That's the one yeah. he talks about. What, what, what happened? Can you repeat? There was a, a very, very famous uh, I know. man, Cal Jung, and he went all the way to India on a boat and he wanted to go and speak to this. Maharishi. Yes. Mm -hmm. ah. And when he got there, he, he just couldn't go off the boat. He just says, no, he says, I'm not getting off. I don't want to talk to him, huh? No, he just couldn't bring it up. For some reason, he but he was very interested. Yeah. He wanted to go there and speak to this yogi. He sent his students to go and speak to him, but he, he couldn't face him himself. Mm -hmm. That's the story. Mm. Both ways. Switzerland. He conducted the course opposite to his mountain. <laughs> 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 you, see, you see, there is a. I will tell you a beautiful story about Mahesh Yogi and myself. Uh -huh. And uh, not story. Once, when, uh, uh, my, one of my. Uh, the founder of the trust, uh, along with Master VK, uh -huh. his name is uh, Burma. Then because of him, our trust was here. He, master is not interested to form a trust. That man is interested. And then, uh, after some time, he left the group. The Varma, who is the founder of the trust, he left the group. And somehow he went to America and he coming back. And from Bombay to Hyderabad, he was in the flight, and some other man was sitting behind, behind besides him. They don't know each other. 
and then they in the discussion uh, they found uh, I am the founder of the World Teacher Trust uh, with Master E.K. and oh, you are the disciple of Master E.K. He said I am no more disciple of Master E.K. I am disciple of Rajanish Osho uh -huh. and said then then the other man asked him, by any chance do you know Master C.H. and Raju? He asked. <laughs> Other man is like, uh, before Varma I am a child, mm -hmm. and then uh, ask by any chance uh, you are telling about the world teacher trust, and by any chance do you know C H S and Raju? Yes, I know him. This man is thinking. By the time I am just forty years old, this this man was thinking after reading my books on astrology. I am some 80 or 90 years old. <laughs> Before, because uh, when, when he read my book and astrology, and uh, Raju is a big name. If you call Raju, it's not a small name. If you call him, if you come to India, if you call me Raju and people look at you, hey, why is this man is calling him as Raju? <laughs> the, 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 and then he said, Raju is such a big man, he said. <laughs> said uh, this man was so surprised, and uh, what do you want from him? Sir, I wanted to see him, sir. <laughs> then he was laughing. <laughs> I don't know. And then, okay, anyhow, I will come to Hyderabad, and he will also come to Hyderabad. I will introduce you to him. By that time, I was, uh, I came to Switzerland three or four times, something like that. And this man telephoned to me and laughing, Oh, Master Raju, somebody wanted to see you. He is uh, some 65 years old, the other man. I telephoned to him and, and sir, I wanted to, you wanted to see me and I am in Hyderabad. I will come and see you. Sir, sir, please come, please come. He was waiting for me like anything, thinking I am a 90 or 80 years old. <laughs> wise man, a great master. I went with my t-shirt <laughs> and a beautiful fan. In those days, curling hair. <laughs> and he opened the door. Who are you? <laughs> I am Raju. You are Raju? <laughs> yes, sir. And I was sitting there with him and uh, he said, I, I thought you are a very old man. Mm -hmm. So, no, sir, I am very young. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like to be old. <laughs> and then, so I, I read your books, they are so beautiful. And uh, can you come with our group? He is the disciple of Mahesh Yogi. And can you come with us and uh, we can take you to all the countries. Uh, we'll give you a secretary and a computer and a house. You have to spend one month in one country. Like that we will take you to all the countries. In those days they used to pay 10,000 rupees per month. <laughs> in those days in the 90s, 92,000 years, something like that. But for you, we pay 30,000 rupees per month. We give the tickets and a secretary to you and a computer to you and a house and everything, we provide everything. What I have to do? You just give the classes and astrology and the consultations. We will pay you 30,000. I will introduce you to Mahesh Yogi, or his uh, next one. And if you are prepared, you please tell. I said, I am sorry. <laughs> I am not interested. Sorry, it is a very great opportunity. You know what I said? Mahesh Yogi is like, like a child before my master. Oh. <laughs> I know it exactly what is Mahesh Yogi. And what is my master? He is just like a child before my master. Why should I leave my master? So I am thank you, sir. Thank you for your good offer. Bye bye. <laughs> you understand? So why I am telling you this is we had such a great master, but he never tried to show it up. Uh, because we show it up, we get millions of people, what you will do with them? 
That is not the way of the masters. People have to understand, understand their goal, understand the purpose of their life, and they should be prepared to work for the humanity, not for themselves. Mm-hmm. Only when, when this thought comes out of our mind, our heart, so now I'm prepared to work for the humanity, for the welfare of the humanity. Then the real master calm down and pick you up. Till then they are not interested. They are not marketing people. I used to, uh, all the time you give me the money, it's just, it's just for joke. And uh, they are not interested in that. They are interested in the people who are ready to work for the welfare of the humanity. That is the only qualification what they need. There is no second line. If you are prepared for that, then they will take care of you. Try. (laughs) 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 Then we will stop. Mi sarà già raccontato la sua esperienza di quando ha incontrato questo signore, questo maestro, scusatemi ma i nomi indiani, mm. ecco, li evito. C'era il suo eh, partner nel trust che era in aereo un giorno e di fianco ha incontrato, ha parlando con qualcuno, ha, ha conosciuto questo maestro e, ed è saltato fuori che... Insomma, che, che che è il padre di Mr. Eh, che quell'altro signore è il partner di Mr. Raggio. Il maestro voleva conoscere, era un maestro questo, vero? Vabbè, un no, signore questa voleva, persona voleva conoscere. Ma questa persona voleva conoscerlo perché era un seguace di questo maestro. Di un altro maestro. Voleva conoscerlo perché aveva letto i suoi libri di astrologia e, e pensava di incontrare, eh, è stato organizzato un incontro e questo signore pensava di incontrare un signore saggio, anziano, invece lui era ancora più giovane di adesso, aveva ancora un po' più di capelli, eccetera, si sono incontrati <ride> con, con un t-shirt, un paio di jeans, metto così, <ride> si sono incontrati e, e hanno parlato. E questo signore voleva offrire a Mr. Raggio un... Un, un job, come si dice, un, no, un no, lavoro no. presso appunto questo maestro qua, ben retribuito, e ben re, ben retribuito eh, offrendogli i viaggi, offrendo che in ogni, per ogni mese veniva portato in un altro posto per eh, insegnare l'astrologia e per fare le consulenze. No. E, però eh, mi sarà giù ha rinunciato a questa offerta, nonostante che fosse appunto ben retribuito, dicendo che questo maestro, quest'altro, è un bambino in confronto al maestro suo e che lui eh, segue il suo maestro. E, e tutto questo per spiegarci appunto che dobbiamo seguire, cioè non dobbiamo seguire, se il nostro eh, scopo, obiettivo è quello di offrire il nostro lavoro spirituale per l'umanità e non per i soldi, noi incontreremo il maestro oppure il maestro si sceglierà, ci sceglierà e ci porterà, ci accompagnerà sulla nostra via. Ecco. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Good, eh? mm-hmm. She told all the things yeah. about my calling. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, sir, thank you very much. So, the syllabus is... Uh, next time we will uh, discuss about Master Maurya. Mm-hmm. Now this time there is no time, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Master Maurya and then... Uh, uh, this time we practice a lot. Uh, and we practice every day. And if there is no time, practice a little thing. Uh, there is no time, practice home one day. And next day you practice the... Greetings. I try to do the prayer regularly. That, that is the only thing uh, I ask you. Try to do the prayer regularly. And everything you will get out of the prayer, it, it is true. Other things, so if you practice, then uh, the progress will be much more faster. Even otherwise, <coughs> the prayer is enough. And uh, read the books, and all the books are there in the website. Master's lectures are there in the in the English. 
I don't think the lectures of uh, masters are in German. Books written by him are in German language, mm-hmm. but uh, I don't think uh, all the lectures given by him uh, nobody translated into Jer- into German. Uh, I'm sure. So you try to read in English. It's small, simple English. The four volumes. Uh, first two volumes. The name is Overseas Messages. Overseas mm-hmm. Messages. First and second volume. Then third and fourth volumes, I have changed the names. There is a call Overseas Message 3 and 4, but I put the name. The last book is last year, a, a wonderful lecture, Know Thyself. Mm-hmm. It's a very wonderful lecture, Know Thyself. Mm-hmm. Now, one of the lectures name. This is the Spiritual Constitution, Overseas Messages 4. The one of the lectures, the name of one of the lectures. So you read those lectures, uh, uh, by yourself slowly, you can download them freely. So I don't think they put any money for it. And then when you read them and if any doubts, you please write to me or uh, you please ask me next time. It's not a big issue. That's why my lectures are there. And what I wanted to tell you, if you have any, if anybody have, if you have, Wi-Fi is very fast here. Wi-Fi. Oh. Hmm. And Wi-Fi is there, then you can uh, download WhatsApp. WhatsApp. Hmm. If you download the WhatsApp and you send me the number, WhatsApp, I will include your name in the WhatsApp. Then I will try to send you a few lines of the Master. Once in a while and once in a week or once in a day, the few lines. So it's a very important thing. The Master's sayings are very good. So you will find a lot of meaning in it. If you can understand by yourself, it is okay. Otherwise, uh, whenever we meet, we can discuss it. So that is the way you have to continue with the teaching. Yeah. Not so many sentences. I will put uh, three or four lines, beautiful lines, in the WhatsApp. You need not spend any money. Anyhow, you, anyhow you are having the Wi-Fi. Mm-hmm. Download WhatsApp, and uh, I will include you in my group, the Wisdom Group. Mm-hmm. My group name is Wisdom. I will, I will include uh, in them and uh, sometimes I will put it in my own language, you forget about it, and you, you can delete it. <laughs> and then if I, if I will put it in English for your sake. So download the WhatsApp and, uh, and I will send you some sentences to continue the teaching. That is good. Right? What else? Thank you for everything. Thank you. 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 Attivare l'energia.